Y'all ready for an adventure, everyone? Go ahead and give me... You didn't throw anything you want in the chat. I'd say H. Give me an H in the chat if you want adventure. But we're going to do it anyway, regardless of what you type. So, will this be a Sonic adventure? No. If you want a Sonic adventure, please go subscribe to the Sunset City podcast where me, Nick, and, uh, Nick from Game Apologist, and Channel Pup discuss Sonic shit. But this is quite the adventure. Let's go on the adventure together, shall we? So, I posted a picture on Twitter at one point saying, have you ever had this mentality before? If so, what changed your mind? The mentality of somebody saying that <clears throat> if you're being sexually assaulted and can stop it by hurting the person assaulting you and you choose not to, then that part's on you. It must not have been that bad if your instincts to protect yourself didn't kick in. Now, for those who don't know, this was on the sexual assault video thing that I covered where Keemstar was involved. I'm not going to go into a lot of that video because that's not the rabbit hole we're going down. We are going over a different rabbit hole entirely, but I will go ahead and very quickly say that uh, if you're being sexually assaulted and you can stop it by hurting the person, you may not know that that is an option that you have, and you cannot assume perfect knowledge, especially in issues of personal duress. Okay? Okay. Cool. We got that part settled. Now! Now that we have that settled, let's talk about me as a government agent. All right? Cool. Let's go. Let's do it. Together. Now, we get a response from this person named Sarah and Patrick. Leave a call for an uprising alone. Jesus is the only truth. Why don't you go after the Muslims or the Buddhists? Leave us truthers alone. So for those who don't know, a truther being like a 9-11 truther, right? Okay, cool. So I pointed out that I go after Muslims as well. I have videos on my channel going after Muslims. But you seem very upset. Do you need a therapy or a hug? Well, actually, no. Maybe a hug from Jesus. Because people like you make me puke. They must pay you well to harass a call for an uprising. Stop doing it. It's not worth it. Leave him alone. If we are so crazy, then let us be to our little crazy corner. It is our right to awaken more if we do. So wait. You think there's a possibility you're crazy, but you're also going to be bringing people into your special little corner. Okay. Okay, dude. Okay. Also, first of all, Ideas do not exist within vacuums. If you put your idea out there on the internet, it is ripe for critique, just as any idea that I put out on the internet is ripe for critique. Now, I did retweet this person saying, sure thing, bud, here's what they pay me. A crisp $40 from the ominous they. I don't harass anyone, much less your precious Jesus proxy, a call for an uprising, because I do think that their ideas are problematic. As a result, I will critique them. But here's where I pointed out the actual money that was made from that call for an uprising video. And now I've got like seven. So I guess if you want to be really truthful, multiply this number by about seven. And that's what I've made over the course of like two years talking about call for an uprising alone. That's enough to pay not even my mortgage. Meep. So then they go, absolute fail. You hide behind your YouTube moniker. No, you are a fucking agent set place to attack a call for an uprising. Nothing you say will ever change my mind. It is absolutely sickening. Satan is the father of all lives. Yeah, am I to believe you? Okay. So now begins the conversation over whether or not I am a government agent. I'm not. There. I've, I've demonstrated the negative. I'm kidding. No, in, in truth, though, 
If I were a government agent, then I would probably make enough money to actually repair my house without issue. If I were a government agent, I would probably make enough money to not have to worry about paying my bills. I would actually probably also, hopefully, get health benefits, so I wouldn't be spending, what, 800 now? No, $900 now. Trying to actually keep our health benefits and dental intact. So, we've begun the adventure, but we have only begun. We have a ways to go in this adventure. We do. We really do. Let me see where the adventure led. Here we are. Let's go. You and me and Sarah and Patrick all together on an adventure. Let's go. And also I verified this person is not a, a child because they actually do have their YouTube channel linked here. And when I went to their YouTube channel, I saw, I got a chance to see how they look. This is a grown ass adult, more than twice my age likely, who legitimately believes that I, an anime cat girl on the internet who's barely able to pay their bills, is a secret government agent whose government appointed duty that the government was paid for was to make response videos to a call for an uprising on youtube.com. This isn't, this isn't parody. This is reality. So, let's go ahead and take a look at what is said here. Yep, that's exactly it. You are leading all these kids into hell with your mind warping BS. Just know that you get away with it for some time, but not forever. Satan is on a chain and can only do so much terror. So him, you, and all of his minions will soon perish. To which I respond, do you have any evidence of this? Any at all? That is the problem right there. This whole world is in turmoil. We went from leaving faith in Christ and God, and now we look frantically for scientific evidence, and anything the government says is the complete truth. You damn well know it's the truth. You're an agent. Okay. I said, right, you say that. I'm asking why you think that. Do you have any evidence of that claim? Anything to go off of? Because the time to believe a claim is not once it's spoken from a random idiot's mouth. The time to believe a claim is when evidence is presented. Because it's the damn truth. The government does not want our kind no more. They are taking us out. Holistic doctors getting shot twice in the back of the head and labeled as suicide. They don't want righteousness or godliness on this earth anymore. I see it plain as day. Quit your psyops. If that was the case, then a large swath of the government would not be aligned directly with Christianity. But I responded that, so you don't really have evidence that I'm a government agent of any kind. You have nothing to go off of. Am I hearing you correctly? So they say, so what official proof am I supposed to go on? Your handlers won't slip up and let any of that info out on the internet. So you just one day started YouTube and mass attacked a call for an uprising? Fuck no, I don't buy that for one instant. Stop your mind warp BS, I see right through you. Jeez, if my channel were actually a psyop, maybe it would be successful. <laughs> that would be great, wouldn't it? So I pointed out that, no, see, I started my YouTube channel in December over three years ago. I've done a handfuls of video on a call, yes, over about, yeah, maybe three. Or uh, over the course of three years, maybe about five, five or eight. I even had him on my channel once to chat. I decided to tackle him because our views do not align. What I didn't say in here as well is our views do not align, and I also find his views to be harmful. Because they create people like Sarah and Patrick. Well, guess what? I could say much the same to you. 
You're attacking us as, as you were attacking you people. We attack the nasty, filthy garbage being forced onto people that don't want no part of it. We are trying to save souls. That path you people lead is evil. So said, we agree that we have differing ideals and thus our paths cross. Excellent. Now that we agree on that, can you accept that I'm merely a person who you disagree with on the internet? And I'm not a secret government agent hired to attack your idiot on YouTube. I said you're idle, but I guess both works. Hell no! Even if hell froze over, you can't play your mind warp psychological BS on me. I know damn well you're an agent. And no, I ain't a troll as these dumb founded runt kids like to spew out. All you hear these days, troll this, troll that. Hey, troll, you! It right, but you still have no evidence that I'm an agent. You've just asserted that. Maybe you're the government agent. I mean, you've been planted to frustrate me. Taking away my valuable time. Sucking George Soros's toes or something. That's it! You're the government agent! You must be him! That's... that's what it is! He has to be the government agent. To which he responds, Fine, go twiddle your thumb somewhere. Leave the kids alone. You damn well know kids use YouTube more than anyone else now. I, there's data to prove that's not true. And you push this tolerance equality BS. Tolerance is Satan's law of love. I am deeply rooted in hardcore Christianity. We need to take it back. Oh God, what is hardcore Christianity? Are there whips? Do you get like whips and shit? Does God, does God rip off your toes, suck them and then like heal them back on? Is that the kinky shit you guys are into these days? Jesus. I said, right, right, tolerance bad, equality bad, blah, blah. Hey, now that I know you're a government agent, could you let me know when we can elect, wink, wink, someone to replace Majorie Taylor Green? Votes don't count. They don't read off every single vote. Hell no. It goes to the shredders. Gosh, you people are so indoctrinated. Or, or, you are a really good agent. God, he's still stuck on this. Yeah, you push it on me to make me look like that. It ain't working. I'm a Christian. I don't kiss their ass. Ah, you can't say ass. It goes against his religion to say ass. Apparently, I guess. I said, Christian Smithian, I just want to know if you can get me a government-issued bagel. I'm kind of hungry. Got any GMO-filled bagels lying around? I mean, I'd figure you, as a government agent, could totally get me a bagel. Blah! Bagel! Who else would say this? Unless this is your mind warp BS too! I am not an elite Zionist, if that is what you are entailing. What? The, dude, Zion? No, I'm just hungry. Like, if it'll help your paranoia, I'll take a sandwich instead. Damn. Bacon, egg, and cheese, preferably. It is breakfast hours, after all. Come on, man. Soros doesn't pay the bills like he used to. Yet Soros and all those bozos live up to their 90s. Their 90s! And yet us worthless eaters die younger and younger as the years go by. Cancer and children? What? So many lies. So this is one. Could it be that being wealthy means easier access to health care while poverty is linked to higher mortality rates? Two. Dude. Bacon, egg, and cheese bagel. I'm hungry. Please? Is this all you think about is food? That's another problem with America. Too much eating. If we actually, for once, were farming and eating real food and stop spraying the skies, we would be okay. The whole sentence made zero sense at all. Elite stay rich, we stay poor. Are the conservatives okay? Are they okay? They said, elite stay rich and we stay poor. Correct. That is a problem that I would like to address. It's kind of why I'm a socialist. I'd like to take that money from the elites and give it to the poor. That said, the poor do need to eat. 
Spray some of those GMOs on my sandwich while you bring it, though. Hey, guess what? You are starting to catch on, but no, you got to do much more than that. I got to be, I have to be a conspiracy theorist. That's what it is. I can't just be against the global elites. I've got to also buy into all the conspiracy theory nonsense. You are starting to catch on, but no, you got to do much more than that. Only way for anything to change now is a revolution and a bloody one at that. The government has their claws in too deep into the American people now to drag them out. So, dude, why do you want a bloody revolution specifically? Like, I'm a reformist socialist. Why do you need blood? Because, as I said, there will never, ever again be change. This great delusion, which is indeed the fake virus that nobody has died of, has caused the government to dig their talons deep into the American people. And, well, most of the world, too. Only way is for the awake to fight. Dude desperately wants to be part of a bloody violent revolution. What the fuck? Said, so you want the bloody revolution that will not work. And you're mad at the virus that has definitely killed people because you believe it hasn't killed people. It's official. Focus less on these fantasies. Focus more on getting me that bagel. Uh, sorry. That sandwich. Okay, you have fun, sir or ma'am or whatever the hell you think you are. Jesus, I am praying that you would please wake up these lost souls who have tormented me to deep hell tonight. So, mind, this person brought all of this torment onto themselves all, all of that quote torment was brought on by themselves by continuing to engage specifically with me and trying to call me a government agent and then calling for a, blo a violent bloody revolution Jesus so I wanted to take you all on that uh adventure where somebody legitimately really truly honestly apparently believes that i am an agent of the united states government paid for only to harass his anime waifu a call for an uprising that's it that's the video i hope you all enjoyed the adventure and the insanity as always, everyone, if you enjoyed my content, please consider supporting me by going to the links in the description below where you will see my Patreon as well as other ways you can support the channel. If you enjoyed what I did, though, please consider giving me a like, consider subscribing if you haven't already. As always, though, everyone, insert end of video tagline here.